Hello, this is Mike Prof. Welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're going to have manicotti. It's an Italian dish. So we're going to take a spoonful of butter, put the butter in the middle of the pan, wait for the butter to cook down a little bit. We wait a couple of maybe seconds. Okay. Then we have a recipe here, which is one cup of flour, one cup of water, and one egg. So, put it in like this, just like you would a pancake. Make sure the butter gets all around. Put about that much, maybe a little more. Okay. And now we wait. So the recipe calls for the um, ingredients that I mentioned, plus some ricotta cheese. If you don't have ricotta in your house, don't go out and buy it. You could use any cheese, mozzarella cheese, and also there's uh, Parmesan cheese. So we wait a couple of minutes for this to cook. It cooks like a pancake. I have two dishes here, one to put it in as soon as I get it out and then one to cook it with. So, the one that I'm gonna cook with will be this one. This is going to be an individual plate, okay? So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come closer and I'm gonna get a dish. And I'm waiting now for this to cook, just like a wood a pancake. As soon as it gets a couple of holes in it, I can turn it over. I don't want it to be too hot, because if it's too hot, it'll stick to the bottom. So, I'm about to turn it over now. There it is. Let it cook about a minute or so on that side. We're going to plate it in here, because it's easier to plate. And then we're going to transfer it. So, while that's cooking another second, we're going to put a little bit of sauce on the bottom. Pre-made sauce, any kind of sauce you have is fine. I'm going to take this, I'm going to put this on in the middle. This is coming out now. Place there. So I'm going to take my pre-made mix. Put it in the center, just like that. Real simple. Okay. I'm gonna close this up. It's not that hot. Be careful with your fingers. Don't burn yourself. Try to put it in here now as quickly as we can. Okay. We're gonna put a little more sauce on here. a little more sauce on top. We're going to put a little cheese. And we're going to put a little bit of parsley. There it is. Cook this for 15 minutes. Maybe 30 minutes, wherever you like. Depends if you keep it in the refrigerator. Put aluminum foil on top. I don't have any aluminum foil, so I'm using parchment paper. So, I'm going to now put it in the oven and hold on one second. Need this. So, I'm going to put this in the oven right now. And as I put this in the oven, I'm going to show you what a cooked plate looks like. Put this in the oven, just like that, and I'm going to cover it for about 15 minutes, and then maybe I'll take the cover off. So timer. Fifteen minutes. Okay. So here's our plate. 
we're going to take a little bit of the sauce. And this is the hard part. You got to go in and you got to try to get one without breaking it. There it is, manicotti. Cooked in your own home, not having to go out. Enjoy your meal. Have a great Sunday. Take care and be well.